For most athletes in a talent-heavy country like Ghana, getting that sole slot out of many can be as daunting as the yearn for silverware. The quest is often a chase for a tiny crown jewel that screams consistent determination and trying to get a leg in. Winifred Intumi is a female weightlifter from Ghana who competes for the Black Rings in the 49 kg division. When they realized what I was doing, at first the support wasn't there really, so they only gave me transportation to training ground. Then it got to a time because that was coming in, so they had to stop giving me transportation. So anytime I go for training and I get back, I have to go to the market and go and sell dry coconuts and roasted maize. That's how I get my income to go for training. So I did that for two years for a year before they started helping me again. She's ranked number one locally and fourth in Africa and has taken part in a number of international championships. The 20-year-old is aware of the intense pressure on her as Ghana gears up to host the 2023 African Games in March next year. For the African Games, I'm doing my best though because my best is not enough because three months ago, I went to Nigeria to train with them because of I lack a lot of things here. It's really a tough competition coming on because the country is looking up on me, family is looking up on me, and I have to make myself, you know, to that level. And I can't do it alone because no support from anywhere. Professional weightlifters in Ghana are few. Winifred is leading the charge in her division. Coach Michael Johnson Aboki believes the prospects are encouraging. Discipline in time of training. She is very hardworking lady, hardworking uh, hard athlete, and uh, she's she's very serious. She's very determined. So I wish she could able to get to the high performance of the sport because she's worked hard. Winifred competed in the women's 45 kg category at the 2019 African Games in Morocco, where she won three bronze medals, becoming the first Ghanaian to do so in the weightlifting competition's history. She also represented Ghana in the women's 49 kg competition at the 2021 World Weightlifting Championships in Uzbekistan. At the 2022 Commonwealth Games, she finished ninth. Now, her Olympic dream is on and she is eager to see it through. My goal is to get to the Olympics, not just once, but twice, and not just to compete, but to be part of the first three as well. Coach Johnson has played a central role in her career and believes her tenacious character will take her far. I've been a very good um, uh, motivation to all the athletes, and um, I've been a very consistent in whatever I'm doing. I always want them to know that their career, their destiny is in their hands. That we can train them, but they have to do what? They have to work hard for themselves. Sometimes to get supplements, it's not. Even magnesium, the chalk you, you saw me train with, we don't get it. We buy it with our own money. Our training equipment and everything, we buy it with our own money. So if a new athlete is coming, and that person is not having all those things. That person cannot even, let me say, be a weightlifter. The food that you see me wear is expensive. It's $300. Who will buy it for you? So you have to gather money to get all this. So it's a lot of challenges that we are facing, which is very bad for us to get to where we want to get to. Winifred will lead Team Ghana as they compete in the 2023 Weightlifting Championships from September 3 to September 17 in Saudi Arabia for a place in Paris. While the task ahead may be Herculean, Winifred will be hoping to circumvent it all. Juliet Bewa for Supersport Blitz.